Hey, what's up everybody? It's Pablo1713. Hi and welcome in Anno 1800 Advanced Guide Gameplay episode number 53. So yeah, we're gonna continue where we just left in the last episode. So yes, we are in the new world and we can finish actually the third phase for our airship. Yes, so the phase number three is completed so we can finish this and we can continue to the phase number four. So the last phase, but as you can see, we're gonna need sails. Oh. So this is very unexpected. So 10 minutes, we got the aluminium profile, so this is not a problem, but we're gonna need to bring the saves from the other sessions because we don't have it. Hmm. As you remember, in the last episode, I made this airship platform and it has some modules and... Wow. Oh, I didn't notice that. So it has some additional uh, UI. As you can see, we can transfer items between the islands. But right now, you know, it will not work because we have only one airship platform on one island. So actually we need to build this on the second island. Look at this, so it is also generating and collecting the mail from from the citizens that are living right in here. And then we can just change it to regional mail and using a trade route to, you know, transfer the mail between the islands. So this is super awesome. And in here, Yes, we're gonna be able to, as you can see, the background at the top with the workforce is different. It's blue, which means that it can be shared with the island, other island that has the platform, so airship platform. Alright, so we got aluminium back, as you can see, we got aluminium 181. So this is good, Your so we can build the post office. Oh, that is very good. And of course, we need to go to the lifestyle needs. And we need to activate this, so they will start to generate the mails. Uh, think that you need to you know activate it for both of the tiers of the people that are living on the island otherwise it will not start generating the mails for uh, for this building so the post office and what more of course as i said before we need to make the platform right so we're gonna go into the airship platform and we're gonna place it somewhere as you can see it is not interacting with any buildings so it just need to be placed somewhere one step closer so it, to connecting the world yeah, that is true, that is true, ladies. So I'm just gonna connect this with the road, just like this. And as you can see, we got some beautification items, so I want to show you them. Why not, right? So you will know how they look. As, as you can see, we got some cafes. We got tables in here where we can just wait for the airships. That we'll get in here, we got some flag. And the clock tower, small clock tower right in here. Some additional seating options for them, and of course, big sign airport and we have here departures okay and i'm just gonna connect everything for the road right in here and let's press ctrl shift and r and we're gonna jump into the first person of course straight into the bushes but but yeah uh look at this we got some food food drinks we got pizza we got some salads some vegetables some fruits so they can wait in here yeah they can eat in here check them time in here and then another seating options for them here we have the airport flag really nice more seating options for them and also we got some parrots in here airport sign a little big one and then we have departures okay, so we can cross this really nice you know this is additional beautification for this platform of course i'm trying to rush things because you know we don't have much time, as always. Okay, so in here, as you can see with the workforce, everything is on the black in here because it is not shared. So when I'm going to change to the island, it will change, as you can see. But once we're going to build the commuter station, it will change, right? So maybe I will place it right in here. Or maybe just like here, one. As you can see, this is changed. And now those two islands that, that have this... A module are sharing the workforce so this means that you can you know ease your pain with the workforce even more thanks to this new dlc and then we're gonna make the sorting mail module and also item transfer depot like this perfect so we got this we can transfer some you know, items between the islands then we can transfer also mail but of course to transfer the mail we're gonna need some airships so we're just gonna need to wait for the airship right in here because this is our hangar right in here of course what's the time six minutes so in six minutes we're gonna have this and we'll be able to continue but in the meantime we're gonna make those 
supply lines for the care packages and so on so on so this is in here as you can see these are those are the factories that we can produce and make uh, so before we're gonna make this let's just check care package factory control t and we're gonna check in the trade union building care package factory yes and as you can see it can be boosted by some items so we can have the productivity up to 100 extra 135 or something like that extra so 235 in total so i think that i have those items item location much trading for well on which island in obi-wan kenobi oh that's great this is also and this one is on solo but solo is connected with this island so maybe i'll be able to transfer the item wait a second uh, let's just double check this so we're gonna check this in practice so we're gonna item the transfer and we want to transfer item from solo into this shared storage and the item will be from the trade union and this is the item so i'm just gonna click it as you can see we're just gonna now wait a few seconds until it's gonna be loaded into the shirt and slot in here and then we can equip it probably in here so we don't have to use now ships and uh, that's you know faster way so let's just build those buildings i just click the wrong item so we're gonna make those make those care packages so yeah this is the the factory it's kind of big but i think that this is gonna be good place or so maybe in here i'm not using this space anyway right let's just double check what about the trade union building there's no trade union no so i can place it like here one and two and then we're gonna make just one warehouse right in here this should be okay and just connect everything to the system with the road okay so we got this we got this factory we can you know get a second tier and now we can just use as you can see this is uh, there's an item in here which means that it can it is shared item so i i think that i need this guy then this guy and let's just double check one more thing if we're gonna go into this item item i don't yeah in here item transfer window can we just drag this item straight into the trade union building like this yes we can <laughs> so yeah we can do this and thanks to that those uh, fabrics gonna work we can select the production oh so we can choose the recipe look at this bombs great bombs a c mines copper deal pamphlets pamphlets we need for wood and cotton which we have 600 600 so maybe we're gonna begin this right now and we're gonna do the same for this for now because we know you we don't cannot have... do my job with soft hands let me tell you that <laughs> yeah i know yeah we cannot make the care packages because we don't have canned food chocolate and also we don't have snaps so we're gonna need to bring this and here we just need water huh <laughs> that is that is interesting okay so yeah we're gonna make pamphlets right now but you know this is our goal so now we're just gonna try to focus to um, getting kind of food chocolate and also snaps in here so now they are producing this is really loud okay i can try to jump into the first person mode Yeah, this is real factory. Okay. Quality control, anybody? No? <laughs> oh. There is no bottom face. That is logical because this is a game. <laughs> okay, this is super awesome. Oh yeah. And we got some pamphlets in here. So yeah, it is work under, you know, they're working really hard in here. This is very good. And of course we're gonna change the recipe later on. Once we're gonna have required goods, of course. So yeah, they are now working right there. We are waiting until this done. And so let's go into the Cape Trilogy. Because of course, as you remember from the previous videos, I have this video about the Docklands DLC where you can have super Docklands with plenty of items, you know. 
And in here, as you can see, we have gold, we have the barcodes and also fishes, and we are exchanging it for chocolate, pennant food, and also schnapps. So this is another problem. What more? As you can see, uh, the link was on the top right corner, so you can check the video because you now we got some production cheese in here, and I just placed in here, here. Uh, additional sales. So thanks to that, I have the production of sales next We're to this trade union builder where we have the wool. So as you can see, we got Angela. She is boosting this, so she's providing electricity for our uh, sail makers. Those. Uh, items are not affecting sail makers, but that's okay because it's still 200% productivity. That's way than enough for me. So we're gonna have plenty of sails because we're gonna, we're gonna need them, right? To produce some airships. So I have my ship in here. Grogu is right in here waiting to be assigned to the new trade route. So I'm gonna create the trade route. And this is gonna be from the... That's gonna be the, the ships from the Cape Trilogy. That's gonna be Grogu. And the name of the trade road is going to be from the Cape Trilogy to New World. And we're going to have like stops. Then there was like chocolate. Sales. And what was there? the last one? Canned food. And F. Canned food. Yeah. So we're going to go in here to Tatooine. We're going to connect. So canned food. Easy. Schnapps. Schnapps should be at the top. Yes, it is. And of course, chocolate. Okay, we got the chocolate. And then we're gonna take also some sales. Just one, I think. One should be enough. Later on, fill it. And we're gonna go into the Obi-Wan Kenobi. And we're just gonna get rid of everything. We're gonna make the safe loop as always and make sure that if there's gonna be not enough space, we're just gonna discard the cargo into the water so there will be no blockages and no problems. So we can accept this and we can start this. So this will provide us with additional items. As you can see, yes, he's loading right now. So we can speed this up. Yes, we got the sails, we got everything. Maybe, uh, you know, I don't know, maybe there's gonna be some other item that will uh, be needed by me in here, so I will just update this trade route, and that's it. And in here we I'm are getting to this. Introduce our new colleague. Oh yes, and we have the new colleague in the research institute, and that item is special lady. It is her. So we're gonna go into the item development to the town hall, and we're gonna write post office. Post office, yes. As you can see, there's only one item for the post office, and this is the New World Science Reporter. And she's providing us extra goods, New World Reports. So she's the only item that can generate the reports. That How will thrilling. be a renowned I don't personage know, has arrived. Important or not, we're gonna see in the future, but this is the only way we can really get knowledge. her. It takes so, you know, it's gonna take a lot of time Mother to never understands this, of create course. her. As you can see, one, two, three, four in the future. This is five. So in total, I have six in the plants. I'm gonna make also this item and then additional items from the previous episodes that I'm talking about, as you can see. I think that those items are gonna be very useful for me. And I have my airship ready in here for this item. I think so. Let's just change to... Yes, he's right in here. So we're just gonna go and take the item. It was for the town halls. She was purple item, right? Yes, she's in here. Perfect. So we got her. We're gonna transfer her into... Hmm, that's a good question. Where are we gonna transfer? Maybe to Obi-Wan Kenobi. Why not? Yeah, why not? So we're gonna have this item and we're gonna go back into the new world right in here where we should... Yes, we got the phase number four completed. So we An can finish the phase. Structure, I must say. Befitting the wondrous craft that we're going to launch. Hey, this is really a huge hangar. And as you can see, we can now build the airships. Super awesome. Right, so now we can have Harpy. Okay, then we have Armed Vation. So... What's the difference except from okay cargo slots two one three and in here we have one two two the speed is also different no the speed is are the same hit points of course it has the same amount of hit points huh even the fact that it is armored so it has only additional cannon as you can see 
And to create this, we're gonna need some sails, aluminium, helium, and also cannons to make the armored version. Hmm, that's interesting. Then we have Medicor and cargo slots 3 to 3. Okay. Then we have armed version and then we have Hermes. Okay, so like we got, okay. Cargo slots 3, 2, and 3 drop shaft available. Okay. Then we have Pegasus. Uh, yeah, cargo slots 5, 3, 4. All right. Then we have Zephyr. Okay, cargo slots 8. Wow, that's a lot. Item slots 2. But the time is 18 minutes, and he'll have just 8. Or Harpy. So I'm gonna just start producing Harpy. As you can see, yeah, we got the. <laughs> Every ship right in here, inside, under construction. And the last one is Boreas. Okay, so he was like the god, uh, Greek god of North Wind or something like that. Not sure. Or maybe West Wind. Probably North Wind. But I'm not sure. We're gonna check it later on. So yeah, we got. The names are like from the ancient Greek. And it's all connected, you know, to flying monsters and some flying gods. <laughs> yeah, very interesting. So this Can't last airship this. has four cargo slots, two item slots and three drop shafts available. So the best ship is Zephyr, for sure, right? The cost is just time influence. We got plenty of influence, so we don't have to worry about this. So for sure I'm just gonna build every type of the ship, because why not, right? So because it's gonna take 9 time, uh, 9 minutes, 10 minutes, 12, 12, 15, 18 and 15. That's a lot. And I'm not sure if I'm gonna have enough of materials. So as you can see, yeah. Maybe not this one. i make this the best one. So yeah, I'm gonna later on pre present everything, probably in the next episode. So we're gonna have all the airships possible. And this will take some time. But once we're gonna have this, we'll be able to transfer the mail. As you can see, we are almost full with mail. Of course, why not jump into the first person mode just to check. Look at this. Wow. Really huge airship. I don't know, is the color, color connected to the color that you choose during the game setup? I'm not sure, maybe. Just trying to jump to make it faster. Yeah, this is the back of the airship, as you can see. Really nice. Yeah, really awesome. I like it. Alright, so look at this. This is our first airship. Look at this. Really cool looking. So this is a harpy. Yes, and look at this, really nice. So this means that we'll be able to transfer the mail. Yes, the royal mail, <laughs> let's say. Yes, this is Harpy, as you can see we got two slots. And also one item, oh, and of course I'm making some other ships. But, first let's uh, solve this problem, so I need to change... No, I'm going to destroy this, and I'm going to destroy everything that we did in last episode. Only a few the problem I here? Bring back the good old quest. times, boss. Find Miguel. Miguel is right in here. <laughs> That's gonna be easy. Way to go. Yeah, <laughs> that was easy. Okay, I'm gonna destroy all the office uh, boxes, post boxes, and everything like that. So yeah, I'm gonna destroy this, and we're gonna change the approach because we need to adjust this. So first, town hall. So I think that we're gonna need to place like one town hall in here, and another one maybe like in here somewhere. That should be perfect. Of course, we don't have bricks. We got the oil spring. I need to move it. I need to move it. Oh, wow. Yes, I need to move it. All right, something like this. And just, I hope that this is going to be in the range of this. Why this is not showing me the radius? I'm going to equip this with this lady. And if I'm going to place it right in here, it should be in the range, right? Just double check. Yeah, it is in range for sure. I can even move it just a little bit. Left. Just like this. It should be still in that range. Of course, I need the bricks, so we're just gonna wait for the bricks. That shouldn't be a problem, right? Uh, this is just a brick. And 
What I have this? Wait a second, wait a second, right? We have this. We can change the production because probably we have already the items. Yes, we have 100, 100, and 100. So we can change. And now we are producing different items. So now we are making those care packages. And we're gonna change too. Care packages. So now we are making two care packages. And in the meantime, we can add additional building that will make those pamphlets, because why not, right? So we're gonna have third fabric right in here. And this should produce, yes, pamphlets. That's, that should be okay. So two care packages How right thrilling. in here. A renowned personage has arrived. And I think that this one a warehouse should, will not handle the amount of work that is in here. So maybe double check radius here. So yeah, I can make one warehouse right in here on this side. Right in here. That should be okay. So we've got two warehouse warehouses that are taking that care of those uh, production chains in here. So this is very good. And because we have the new airship, of course, we can now make the new trade route. So we're going to make the trade route. Let's just cancel this and do this differently. We're going to go in here, create, and we're going to make the airship. We're going to go from this island to this island. going to take the new airship that we have. And the loads good will be the local mail. And this will going to be transported. And here we're going to also... Arctic reports, new world reports. Oh, interesting. So yeah, we're gonna do something like this. And we can actually do like this also. Okay, he got two cargo slots, so that will be the maximum amount. So 100 mail from one island to another one. As you can see, we have the information how much mail we have. 4, 13, 12. Okay, so let's accept this and he will start this trade route. I'm gonna just observe how he's gonna land. Okay, so he's landing on this platform right in here. And then they're just giving him some mail and everything. Your ship has returned from its voyage. Yeah. And he just took off. Just like that. So now we can actually change probably in here to make it also regional mail. And now we'll start generating so the regional mail. But of course we don't have right now uh, enough wood. So we need to... I mean bricks. So I need to bring the bricks. Always so many problems, of course. What goes hey, we're up gonna have the bricks. Come down. That oh. is true. Alright, so let's close this and make sure that we have the post office done. Perfect. And this should be in the range of this. Yes, this is working. As you can see, I now we are generating those new world reports. So like your airship and let appreciate a drop run. Yeah, we're gonna make this, no worries. But now, right now we're just you know, getting the mail done. Yes, this is also working again. So now I'm just going to make additional post Ship office. Oh yeah, we got this. <laughs> everything is do is going on. Everything is really fast. Okay, so I need to place it in the radius. Oh man, this is really terrible. I could have something like this. Make the blueprint, okay. Lapping radius. So what if I'm gonna place it right in here and then have the town hall just in here on the edge? The lapping should be okay, I think. This should be in range also. So if once I'm gonna have the same lady, I'm gonna generate the rape reports also from the different one. Post office, so from this one, so now I can just build this, connect this with the road, like this, and like this. Why is to take time so to learn the new More people are in the range of the post offices right in here. Okay, so we got those small areas where we can just make those post boxes if we can, if we can fit. No, we cannot fit it. Oh, oh man. So, yeah, we can only afford to place one in here. And that should be okay, right? So everybody will be able to access the mail in here. 
and in here as well. So let's go back into this island in here and just double check can they get the mail? No, we need to activate it manually and manually as well. So now everybody should have it now. Yes, they are now generating the mail. Regional mail. That's perfect. And overseas, of course, will be available once we're going to build the uh, platform for airships in the other session. So, you know, in the New World or in the Cape Trillion or whatever. I mean, Old World. Well, Alright, so we got the new ship. Securing their expertise. This is the armed version, as you can see. Yeah, we got some guns in here. Look at this. Okay. Much more armory looking airship. <laughs> I mean... Uh, this cannon on the top it's not very convenient to attack any target on the on the ground <laughs> it will be very hard but okay okay control G we got this and now we can now transfer menu we got items we should have those care packages somewhere the pamphlets this is the care packages okay we're gonna take 39 and now we're gonna make the plan drop run. Okay, choose the number of the drop goods to load into each shaft, okay? You can evenly distribute them or load them all into one shaft. Okay. The so maximum is 5 and 5. Set the drop target. I don't know, maybe doors. here? Oh, 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 okay, so we can... Make like the run. So why Delivering not payload. like this? What's gonna happen now? Oh, he's dropping the packages. This looks promising. Package receipt. Oh, so it's better to have the drops in the middle of the town, like Open the hatch. maybe in here and here. Oh, and that's the direction. Okay, so he should start from this way and direct into this direction. Okay. Package received. Package <laughs> received. Okay. Makes me want to but keep striving. So we have plus twenty-five happiness, chances of riots minus sixty, and effect stage one to three. Remaining time five minutes. How thrilling! Okay. A renowned personage has arrived. Okay, living a joyous it's interesting, life. but Ready it can orders. be very overwhelming because you need to do this manually. I mean, let's just make a different drop like in here now. So, set the Open drop the target for here, here, and this is the direction it goes. So from here, up, down, here. <laughs> okay, okay, that was a good drop, I guess. We have some nine more, so hatch. we can drop in here and maybe in here. Very fast, this is really super fast. Oh, we missed. Okay, so. All right, so I had another crash. <laughs> so, <laughs> normal thing. So we got manicure in here. As you can see, this is not the arm version. This is normal, standard one. And this airship has three cargo slots and two item slots. And if we're gonna go and check and get some goods, like I don't know, effect applied for. Okay, like this. We're gonna check is the drop yet. It has increased the amount of drop, as you can see. Now he had like three. So if we're gonna make the drop, we can now have three targets. Uh, oh, and but this can only be dropped on the enemy islands. Okay, that was there was. Okay, that was the reason there was only information about the negative effect. So yeah, we can you know sabotage enemy islands with We're this. In the presence of we can a drop some pamphlets and they will be unhappy and make some riots. So yeah, this is how we can make the drops but only on enemy islands and because 
you remember I don't have any enemies in here because I defeated everybody and there's no way to introduce new AI players in here then I am alone alone in here so yeah throwing overboard oh it's this thing moving. yeah <laughs> let's change it and just bring it back in here so there's no point for me to produce pamphlets actually so let's just adjust this a little bit and one, one, one more thing, one more thing. Uh, wait Ready a second. What's the speed of this ship? 41. And that was 51. So it is slower version, 41. Let's flat. just move it in here. But, but in the meter I can like send him and this one into like the Cape Trilogy to New Hope. And we're going to see how fast they're going to go and how fast they're going to get into the New Hope. So yeah, they're gonna travel at the same time. We're gonna see what's uh, what's gonna be the difference in time. All right. So for sure, there's no point to produce pamphlets. So we need to change this maybe to bombs and sea mines just to check how they look. But we're gonna need dynamite, steel, and copper. And now I'm thinking about something because you know we are using uh, a trade route, a trade route to get. The items for the for the care packages and we can you know change it because we don't need the, this amount of goods so we're just gonna need copper dynamite and also steel okay so we're gonna go into the cape trilogy okay we got tatooine right in here and we just gonna change the export import yeah that's great we have this and we import the copper yes we can Great, so we're gonna import the copper, also steel. Maybe we have steel, we got only 50, okay. We're gonna have copper, steel, and the one, last one was dynamite, right? And dynamite, that's perfect. So I'm just gonna use the goods that I have in here. So, for example, tallow, I have plenty of tallow, why not? And the amount, eh, 200 will be enough. 200, and Takes then we're gonna use some fishes, maybe. From simple folks fare. Also, 200. While they might grind oh, wow. your gears, okay, many that's... a family would starve without Maybe just fur coats. Fur coats, just 200. That's okay. And then we're gonna have, like, I don't know, swing machines. No, we cannot. So, fishes. No, fishes are not good. So, maybe ah, more fur coats. Why not? And again, just 200. Perfect. So in the next 11 minutes, we're gonna have the uh, Captain Tobias. So he's gonna bring us some additional goods. And we just need to adjust the trade and just steal. And we're just gonna unload everything and make the safe loop. So this is a new version. We still got one more slot, so we can add additional item later on. So yeah, this will provide us with additional items, which means that we're able to create bombs. But we're gonna continue this in the next episode because this one, of course, is getting too, too long again. So All right, so I had another crash, as you know. But you know what I did differently this time? I sent the ships, but also hey. sent the Lord Vader. So the Your ship, ship has returned from its voyage. And he was the fastest ship right now, you see? The second is the Harpy. And where is the last one? Should be in the session already, yes, but he's still, you know, Hovering. so the old ship is still the fastest one. Hmm, that's very interesting. I'm gonna test it again later on to see if this is the true, but this is how it looks. Because I sent them at the same time, and they were starting from the same island, how from the only one Kenobi, and the first one arrived. was Lord Vader. Hmm. You know, Lord Vader must be first, always, right? So <laughs> this is normal. So yeah, then we have the Harpy, and the last one, we're still waiting for this airship. So Manticore. Yeah. It's not even this one. It's here, yeah. So the airspeed 41. Waiting course. Hmm. That's very interesting. Hmm. Very interesting result. But yeah, we got those airships right in here, and I think that we're gonna finish right in here as well. And because, you know, we're gonna continue in the next episode, hopefully without any crashes, <laughs> you know, not like today. So yeah, that's gonna be today, boys and girls, thanks a lot for watching, I hope that you had some fun with me, and I hope that we're gonna meet each other next time. So boys and girls, have a wonderful day, and if you're watching this at night, then good night. <laughs> See you next time.
spinning.